Happy Sunday, everybody. Um, I've got an early little free symbol I'm going to give away today. I was working on helping out one of my plants survive at my house, and I just decided to make that plant. But instead of just making that plant specifically, I thought it might be fun to make it so that you can create your own version of this particular plant. So what I've done here is I've architecturally blocked a couple of different polyline distribution regions. So we'll place it, we'll explode this block, and then what I would have you do is, well, you can make a copy of one of these to kind of see what they're doing, but all this is is a distribution path so that if you kind of shape it, you can get your own kind of leaf texture here. Oops. Let's just get this in shape. There we go. So from here, I'm going to convert this to a symbol. And I'm not going to add it to the library. But I will show advanced options because I'm going to have to one do, do one thing. The distribution paths don't work in an elevation for this particular use. So I'm going to check rotation in Y and then do a negative 90 degree rotation. There we go. And now I can place it as a symbol. Let me go ahead and do this to the next one. Actually, the next three. I'm going to do that same action. Rotate it Y, negative 90 degrees. Go ahead and place it. So we're converting to a symbol, rotating negative 90, and then placing that symbol. If we do this the last one. Now that I have these, I can kind of group them together, rotate them how I'd like to rotate them, kind of get them in place. And I might do something like place a point and in the center of this block and then change my edit mode, edit behaviors to rotate resize about current point. And then I can shift marquee, select this copy, pull my rotate handle and rotate it about that point. Do it again. Do one more. Just like that. Now that I have this grouping, I'll throw it to the corner of the room here and get rid of these distribution paths. Done with those now. And let's make a little planter just to show this go out right. Right. So I'm going to just draw out a box here, uncheck polar. Let's make it a 24 inch by 24 inch planter. There we go. Right in the middle here. And then I can copy this, drag this edit handle in, maybe two inches polar. And then we can convert this and then reconvert it to a solid hole. There we go. Let's take a look at what this looks like in 3D. We might drop a couple windows in here. Kind of interesting, right? grab all of these and let's just move these up in our Z Delta. Let's move them up, I don't know, 30 inches or so. Drop a couple windows in here. Let's extend our planter up. See what this looks like. Not bad, right? And you can play around with these and you can shape them any way you want. Kind of position them any way you need to to kind of make it look realistic for your scene. I'll get rid of this one. All right? Looks pretty good. Anyways, enjoy. Let me know if you have any questions.